What's up, Pharmacy Nation? I'm Pharmacy Joe. Thank you for listening to the Elective Rotation, a critical care pharmacy podcast. This is episode 389. In this episode, I'll discuss whether to use fentolamine to treat dobutamine extravasation. I have all the evidence supporting today's show linked up in the show notes at pharmacyjoe.com slash episode 389. Extravasation of vasopressors is of great concern due to vasoconstriction and tissue necrosis at the site of extravasation. Since the vasoconstriction is due to alpha-1 adrenergic agonism, fentolamine works as a direct antidote to extravasation by blocking alpha-1 receptors. Dobutamine is clinically used as an inotrope, not a vasopressor, leading clinicians to question whether extravasation from dobutamine should be treated with fentolamine. Despite being classified as an inotrope, the L-isomer of dobutamine has alpha-1 adrenergic effects. There is a case report of dermal necrosis from dobutamine extravasation. In this report, the authors did not give fentolamine only because of the time that had elapsed between when the extravasation happened and when it was recognized. For dobutamine extravasation that is caught early and before necrosis occurs, I prefer to use fentolamine in the same manner as I would for a vasopressor extravasation. To get a copy of the seven questions I use for guided topic discussions on vasopressors, sign up for my free download area at pharmacyjoe.com free. It's download number 17 on the list. Thank you so much for listening. I'll see you in the next episode of the Elective Rotation. 